Hello, and here we are for part 11 of Spirit of the North. our final part. I'm not sure, but it sort of feels like we're reaching some sort of conclusion to our story and our journey. So I was here in front of, or rather behind of, these two fox, particularly large statues. I'd found a few other statues scattered around where I was activating the light aurora borealis effect and we have a symbol here of, and it's like one fox at the top sleeping it looks like and the one at the bottom awake so going from sleep to being awakened um, so yeah i was trying to figure out if there's a way into this castle, which I thought would be there, but it is not, apparently, so, I don't know, maybe, oh, whoa, that was no good, uh, so maybe if I can get back up that way, yeah, I feel like this is must be our destination because we've been wandering these mystical woods for well a little bit and uh, yeah just activating those statues seemed to be all we could do and then coming across the occasional monk uh, I think I looked in there before. Looked up there. Did I go in here? I'm not sure that I did. Let's, let's see where this goes. Maybe a way in? This is where, yeah, we came across our monk strolling along here. But does that mean? Oh, he walks through me again. What did I say, monk? That's bad ghost etiquette. Is that a doorway? Aha. Maybe I have found a path into the castle. Yeah, this looks like it has potential. Oh, the music seems perfectly timed for the suspense of going up these steps. Oh yeah, look. Lots of fox statues. And blue flame as well. Oh look, there's something down there. But is there anything is there anything here? Just Oh there's another monk there. Oh, there's lots to see. Okay, good. I think we've made our way into that sort of going deeper in. But, uh... What will be in here, I wonder? Oh, it's just a room. I oh, know there's more. I feel like 
let's just because I feel like that's going to go deeper into the castle but I want to have a look just to see if there's anything interesting to find around here we have another monk hello I wonder if the number of monks wandering around here is affected by the ones that I came across on my journey. Namaste, monk. What are you doing? Oh, and he did a little namaste. So I think here we're above the entrance. Yeah, exactly. It's nicely above. a lot to explore on another illuminated fox so let's, uh, let's head further down back in that bit that we looked at before Ooh. Thinking, philosophizing, doing your bank stuff. quite nice having these monks wandering around because effectively everywhere we've been up until now can I activate? No. Everywhere we've been up until now there's had no life at all. So is that it? No. There's more. Oh look, we've got our navy. Aha. Uh -huh. 
Ah, so we found something important, I think. Waiting us. Yeah, it's uh, responding. Oh, is this? Is this where I was looking down on from before? No, this is. This is the centre. We have three mugs discussing. Oh, look, it's me. What are they doing? Are they trying to decide what to do with me? Do I need to activate this? Bringing me back to life, maybe some sort of resurrection. Yeah. We're back. So what do we do? Come in with me. The monks are happy, and I guess we're going this way. Still following? Back. Okay, so we're two foxes now. Do we need to go here? Yeah. You and me, buddy. Fox duo. tunnel coming out from the castle. Are we going to slide or something? Still with us? Yeah. Okay. Where is this leading? Pretty nice. Is this the path that the previous statues were showing us that was winding through? The following? Yeah. Is this going to lead us back to reality? Or is this another sort of ascension of something? I have no idea. It's all remaining quite a mystery. Great journey, but I'm not sure I'm any the wiser to what is going on and what has been going on. Who indeed even is our 
a fox. How much does the fox know about this thing? Do you know anything? Ah, oh, going all the way through to another castle, perhaps. sound. I'm not sure what that is. I'm not sure if that's some sort of audio interference or if that's uh, an effect of this magical plane. Aha! We have reached the end. What's Me and my fox friend. Jump ahead. Oh, I see something glowing over there. Oh. Ah, yes, of course, this is where our fox was. Why? Yes, are we returning back to life? So are we kind of two fox spirits in one? Is that what we are? Hmm. Okay. Well, we're back. Oh yes, yeah, so this is where we were, where we passed out and seemingly died, but we've made it through now to another statue. Oh, and there's a ghost of the spirits there. Hello. Okay. Bah. I don't really know what's happened to our Navi after she turned red. The door though here, that's... That leads to nowhere. Yeah, our Navi turned red and... Uh, and is gone. Or has... I suppose originally it was a spirit fox that turned into the fairy navi thing. So maybe is this navi returned to fox, spirit fox form? We have our red sun or moon. Are we inside the mountain at this point? So many questions. Oh, here we are, we're at the, oh yes, we're at the source, we're at the peak. Okay, what are we going to do? Lead the way. Are we going to finally use our magic and purify this land? I wonder if it will somehow bring the people back. They all seem to turn to skeletons, I suppose. Even if it doesn't bring them back, at least it uh, 
frees the land to for others, other life maybe. Yeah, something big is definitely gonna happen. the two foxes. Okay, I think we've done it. simply needs to be the two magical foxes sleeping here. Oh look, I can create my own Aurora Borealis. That's nice. Oh, look at that. Oh wow. Oh, nice. Oh, are we at the end? We are. So I guess we've purified this land and, and now we can just simply play and have fun. There we go. But I suppose the land, the monks have still all died, and I guess those cities remain in ruin. And these two, do they just simply sleep forever and ever? What, uh, Will this civilization ever return? Are there other people? I suppose we'll never know. But our purpose was to return. So I don't know if our fox was the original fox or if the original one of the pair that was missing had died perhaps or faded away and so another one was called the spirits of the north yeah. well, I've totally we hope you've enjoyed the spirits of the north continue playing uh, yes why not playing. Wow, well, thank you. Thank you for making. I realise I totally wasn't paying attention to any of those credits or messages there, but never mind. Look at that. So I guess that's it for this game. This is, uh, I suppose it lets us 
fly around and create beams of light. How far can we go? And, uh, yeah, it's been really pleasurable. A really nice journey, the whole thing. I've, uh, I've actually thoroughly enjoyed it. There are a couple of frustrating moments, but really nothing big. I think there was a lot, actually, that uh, perhaps I could have explored further. There were definitely some areas where, which I perhaps missed, I could have found some more in. And definitely some monks, there were some more monks to find from the indications it, it showed there, in those symbols that would appear. There were more monks scattered around, but... Uh, but yeah, definitely warrants a another playthrough at some point. But for now, as we gaze back down on the mountain with Aurora Borealis going on, I suppose that's that's it for our journey, our spirit in the north. Nice little finale actually this, nice uh, nice epilogue. So yeah, really excellent game, thoroughly enjoyable and, uh, and always nice as I said at the beginning to play as an animal, to play as a fox. I think uh, maybe the first time I've played as a fox in a game. And that's it. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this series and enjoyed the music and the lovely visuals of this game as much as I have and I hope you will join me on the next playthrough, the next game I will discover. And so I bid you farewell, take care and stay warm and see you next time. Goodbye for now.